Digital Multiverse Besides our physical universe of matter and energy, advanced civilizations running complex simulations generate vast digital universes. In the future, computers may become so advanced that they can create virtual worlds that seem completely real to the beings living inside them. And the craziest part about all of this is that these virtual beings won't know their world is just a simulation created by an advanced civilization. Some scientists think advanced alien civilizations may already be doing this, creating digital universes with artificial intelligence beings living inside that don't realize their world isn't real. There could be many reasons to make these digital worlds, for entertainment, research, or to learn about their history. The idea is that reality may not be just the physical world we know. Many levels of advanced virtual realities and simulations could be beyond our comprehension. Our universe could even be one of these simulations made by a higher intelligence we cannot understand. Parent Universe Theory it essentially thinks that our universe and others like it were intentionally created by an extremely advanced civilization in a separate parent universe. Our universe exists within a lab or computer system in the parent universe, almost like an experiment or simulation. The parent civilization has space and energy resources far beyond our comprehension and can design and seed many child universes. Each created universe may have different constants fine-tuned by the parent universe engineers. Our universe appears bio-friendly by design rather than by chance. The parent universe, therefore, acts as a cosmic womb. It nurtures developing universes like our own. Testing the parent universe theory may be impossible unless we can somehow contact the hypothetical beings in the parent universe. Anthropic Multiverse The Anthropic Multiverse theory takes that concept of branching timelines and explodes it into infinity. It proposes that our universe isn't the only one, but of countless universes in a huge multiverse. Put yourself in a cosmic forest, each tree a unique universe with its own set of physical laws and constants like the speed of light or the strength of gravity. The conditions would not allow life to develop in most of these universes, but in a very very small number of universes, the conditions would be just right for life and intelligence to emerge. Our universe seems finely tuned for it, with physical constants that are precisely balanced to enable stars, planets, and life to develop. According to the anthropic multiverse view, we only find ourselves in a life-permitting universe because we couldn't exist in any other universe that cannot support life. Infinite Inflationary Multiverse the infinite inflation idea starts with the Big Bang. Physicists think the universe underwent a rapid expansion called inflation, like a balloon inflating. This inflation then slowed down in our part of space and our universe was formed. But eternal inflation says that inflation never completely stopped. It just kept going at full speed in other regions of space. Different parts of space stop inflating at different times. So when inflation stops, a new bubble universe like our own is formed. Meanwhile, inflation keeps going forever in other parts of space, meaning formation of new bubble universes never ends. The other bubble universes can have different laws of physics and properties. We can never see them because inflation pushes them apart way too fast. Alien Multiverse According to this view, the universe we observe is just one of many parallel universes, each populated by life and intelligence that evolved under different conditions. Alien universes may have varying laws of physics, dimensions of time and space, and histories entirely independent from our universe. Some versions of this theory suggest that very advanced alien civilizations may have achieved the technological ability to travel between or even manipulate these parallel universes through portals, wormholes, or warping space-time. The alien multiverse allows for diverse life and cultures far beyond what exists on Earth. Each separate universe in the multiverse essentially holds its own alien societies, technologies, and scientific mysteries awaiting discovery. Historical Multiverse The historical multiverse suggests that time itself may have a multiverse structure. We experience time flowing in one direction, from past to future, but some theories propose time can branch. At different events, time splits into multiple paths. Each path represents a different timeline 
a different history unfolding. Put yourself in the position of blowing bubbles. Each bubble is a universe. In some bubbles, the wind might blow them one way, let's say this is our universe, but in other bubbles, the wind might blow them a different way, creating entirely different universes with different histories. So from one timeline, another timeline branches off, then those branch into more timelines, and so on. In one timeline, you decide to have that extra slice of cake, and in another, you skip it and go for a run. These seemingly minor choices can lead to vastly different life paths. The result is a historical multiverse containing every possible version of history branching out. We can only experience one timeline at a time, but the other branches still exist in parallel. String Universe Theory At the most basic level, particles are not dots, but tiny vibrating strings. Different vibrations of the strings lead to different particle properties. String Theory requires extra dimensions of space beyond our usual three, likely coiled up at very tiny scales. Within these theoretical extra dimensions, our universe may be one of many parallel universes collectively forming a multiverse. The other universes can have different dimensional structures, like different ways to view space and time, and particle types based on their unique string vibrations. Consider a character in a 2D cartoon who can only perceive two dimensions dimensions, left, right, and up down. They can't conceive of moving in or out of the page because that direction doesn't exist in their world. Similarly, we live in a 3D world and can't easily perceive or interact with any additional dimensions that might exist beyond our own. These additional dimensions proposed by string theory suggest our 3D universe is just one page in a vast book filled with other universes, each with its own set of dimensions and physical laws. While we can't see these extra dimensions or the other universes, the mathematics behind string theory suggests they are real. Tegmark's Levels of Multiverse Tegmark categorizes multiverses into four types ordered by increasing theory from our known physics. Level 1. It says our observable universe with its galaxies and physical laws is just a small part of a much vaster space. Beyond what we can see, there are likely other regions of space similar to ours with the same basic physics. Level 2. This suggests other bubble universes were spawned after the Big Bang, with different physics than our region. It's like expanding soap bubbles that form with slightly different laws. Level 3 comes from quantum mechanics, which says that events cause reality to branch into multiple alternate histories and futures. It's similar to the parallel worlds in sci-fi. Every possible outcome exists in some parallel world. Level 4. All fictional worlds would be real in this endless, limitless multiverse. Mirror Universes With this, alternate worlds exist that are perfect reflections or opposites of our universe. For example, there may be an antimatter-dominated universe with reversed laws of physics, or an inverted universe where time runs backward. Mirror universes could exist alongside our own as part of a larger multiverse structure but remain unseen. Travel between universes may be possible if mirror points could be identified where the universes touch. Testing the hypothesis is also difficult since, by definition, mirror universes contain no new information, just reflections or inversions of our own universe's contents. Multiverse of Mind it explains that a mental multiverse also exists alongside with the physical universe. This mental multiverse is made up of all possible minds and conscious experiences. Like when you dream at night, your mind creates a whole imaginary world. Other people also dream up their worlds. So the mental multiverse is active at night with billions of dream worlds from people's sleeping minds. Even when awake, our minds can imagine various scenarios and alternate realities. You can daydream about being an astronaut, a wizard, or anything. So the mental multiverse includes all the possible realities we can imagine. Certain theories suggest fictional worlds like Harry Potter or Star Wars exist in the mental multiverse. Along with dreams and daydreams, the multiverse of minds contains all the imagination and creativity of conscious beings. This mental realm 
realm exists alongside the physical universe. The two interact through our brains. But the mental multiverse is made of thoughts, feelings, and experiences, not physical. Dark Energy Multiverse Dark energy is the name scientists gave to the mysterious force making the universe expand faster and faster. Some theories suggest this dark energy is evenly spread throughout space. Its repulsive gravity pushes galaxies away from each other, stretching out space. But another idea is that dark energy comes in patches or blobs throughout space. Then galaxies get pushed away from the blobs. This patchy dark energy theory predicts our universe will expand forever but it also creates other universes. Wherever there's a blob of dark energy, it will expand into a whole new universe bubble. Our universe is one of these bubbles. So in this theory, dark energy creates new bubbles endlessly across the huge field it exists in. Each bubble forms a separate universe. Depending on the dark energy differences, these universes can have different laws and properties. The key evidence would be finding that dark energy varies across space instead of being uniform. That could support the patchy multiverse concept. Seeding Universes There is the possibility of creating entirely new universes, not through random chance, but through the deliberate actions of an advanced civilization. These hypothetical seeders wouldn't be limited by the physical laws of our universe, meaning they could make anything come into existence in infinite universes. These advanced beings can manipulate energy on a massive scale, essentially setting the stage for a new Big Bang, but with specific parameters chosen by the seeders. Perhaps they could tweak the fundamental constants of physics within the new universe, influencing things like gravity's strength or certain particles' existence. This control over reality allows them to create universes designed to support life, potentially seeding them with the building blocks necessary for biological evolution. The seeders may be driven by scientific curiosity, a desire to expand their knowledge of the multiverse, and witness the birth and evolution of new realities. They may search for a specific type of universe with characteristics that perfectly suit their needs or a specific life they hope to cultivate. Tetrahedral Space-Time Multiverse the tetrahedral space-time multiverse theory explores the extra dimensions that string theory proposes beyond our familiar 3D space of length, width, height, and 1D time forwards. Instead of picturing these extra dimensions as smooth and continuous, this theory suggests they might be curled up in a specific way, the shape of a tetrahedron a pyramid with triangular faces. The way these tetrahedra are arranged in the higher dimensions influences the physical laws of the universes they contain. We'd be looking at a vast cosmic Tetris board, with each configuration of tetrahedra dictating a different set of reality rules. One arrangement might lead to a universe with strong nuclear forces, another with entirely different particles. Our observable universe would simply be one specific arrangement within this board.